Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to yet another Crispy Dubs Cards video. I am Rich, I am your host, and today we have a review for the channel. This is a debut, uh, debut product, debut, uh, yeah, this is actually the debut edition of it. You know, it's a lot of debuts, but uh, I'm really excited to open this. Um, I'm, I've been kind of contemplating getting the hobby version of this. But I ended up seeing the retail version, so I hope you guys are as excited as I am. If you have opened this, let me know what you got, if you got anything cool. Uh, I know this stuff is, either people love it, they're kind of on the fence. I haven't really heard anybody that has hated it. I think most people that don't like it are kind of wondering why it's a thing. Like, do we really need it, just based on how much is out there? So, uh, yeah, you also have to let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, yeah, if you, this is your first time joining us, welcome to the channel. Please, if you would, slap a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't, and hit the bell. It'll let you know when all the new videos are coming out. We're going to start rolling them out, you know, more often, so uh, feel free to hit that. But without further ado, let's show you what we're going to be opening today. And that is going to be... We have two. One, two. I actually bought one of these. Found another one, and I thought... Uh, might, might as well. I was going to just do the one and then I saw another one and it isn't like a super expensive product, uh, but you do get the one out of one man, very similar to contenders. So I thought two would be good for this one. Um, we're not really focusing a lot on the retail, but we're like an everyman kind of channel. So we wanted to show off, uh, you know, give it a good review rather than just the one, just because you never really know, you know. Sorry, had to take a drink there. A little dry. All right, so let's see what we can come up with. We'll take our large knife. We'll cut this one. We'll cut this one. Um, so the people that have had, like, it, it's not even, like, an issue. Um, but the people that have wondered, like, well, who's this for? Why do they have it? It's because it is, is another Panini baseball product. And they have so many out there. Prism. Contenders. Uh, insert other ones here. What? Uh, select? Technically? I mean, absolute. Like they have a lot. So it's just, it's an interesting product. It's I don't. I think it's uh, from the stuff that I've seen. I think it's cool. Um, but yeah, as you can see, debut edition. We're looking at five cards per pack, six packs per box. Um. So there's uh, Blaster exclusive rookie materials, uh, six exclusive blues, and if you want to take a look, that's all those. But yeah, these cards look pretty cool, so I'm excited to show them off. And uh, yeah, let's. This will be a debut, and I have. I mean, I've only seen videos of this, so this will be a. This will be a first. All right, so we'll just show the first one. Joe Ryan, but you can see all the cards are very thick. It's a very simple look, but you can see got a cool, like, hollow design. All right. Reese, Knurr, Anthony Rizzo. There's a blue Alejo Lopez and a big bang. That's a cool insert. Cody Bellinger. That's a cool insert. I like that. All right, number two. All right, Colton Welter, Welker, rookie. Eric Hosmer. CJ Abrams, and that's that textured blue. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool. Jeremy Pena, blue, rookie. A deja vu of Wander Franco and Fernando Tatis. Look at that. That's really cool. Well, you know what we're going to do? We're going to... There's the back of that. We're going to set that over there. That'll be our first cool card. All right, here we go. Ryan Valade, rookie. Andrew Benintendi. Riley Adams. There's a blue of Bryce Elder. And a new age... Ozzy Albies, look at that. So they did it, I mean, they're introducing a lot of new, based on this being a debut product, 
uh, new inserts, new styles. That one's a little thicker. I'm going to guess that's a mem. We'll keep that right in the center. All right. There's a Seiya Suzuki rookie. Mike Bauman rookie. There's an Otto Lopez. I think that's a gold. Otto Lopez. That it is a it is a gold. It is a little different. It doesn't have the yeah Otto Lopez rookie gold. Drew Ellis blue rookie. And a crest. That looks like Crusade right there. Very cool looking though. All right, two more to go. First one. All right, Jose Siri. Pablo Lopez just got traded to Minnesota. Brandon Marsh, rookie. Corbin Burns, blue. And a Clayton Kershaw Summit. Look at that, that's pretty cool. All right, here, yeah, last one. There should be a mem. Oh, yeah, there is a mem. We'll do this. Luis Robert, blue. Nick Lodolo on the velo. That's pretty cool looking. Rafi Devers. Ozuna. And we'll do a flip. Wow, look at that, guys. Holy, that's awesome. Brian De La Cruz, one of 25. Beautiful. I gotta touch it. Look at that patch, four color patch. Well, it's four colors. You, you know what I mean. Brian De La Cruz, welcome. And then there's that Ozuna again. Wow, okay. Uh, that's a good debut, I guess. Nice patch right off the bat. Got a cool liner. Bunch of rookies. If you're looking for rookies, this stuff is absolutely what you should be looking for. The whole, basically the whole, uh, the whole box had tons and tons of rookies. Panini likes, definitely, definitely has more rookies than a lot of, I feel like a lot of products. Alright, here we go. Rodolfo Castro, rookie. Kyle Tucker. Oh, that's a stick. Trey Mancini. A Nolan Arenado blue. And Aaron Judge on the Big Bang. All right. Vidal Bruhan, rookie. Yuan Adan, rookie. A Walker Bueller on that cool textured blue. And I don't believe those are numbered. No, they're not numbered. Mike Trout Blue. That's a good one to get. And a Lucas Giolito on the Velo. Some damage, though, on that one. Oh, it's all, yeah, it's got the glue. Hopefully we could pull an auto. That would be nice. All right, Otto Lopez, rookie. Jesse Winker. Jackson Cower. That's a base. Yeah, basically a base, but that textured version. Nice rookie right there. Tyoscar Hernandez, blue. And a new age of Shohei Otani. I do, I will say, I love the thickness of these cards. And they really, uh, they make you, they make you feel like there's a lot of quality. Oh, there, it's our hit in that one. So we're going to set that right in the center. All right, Greg Dykeman, Taylor Rogers, Dylan Cease, gold. And again, I don't think those are numbered. They're not. Nice gold, though. Ronald Acuna Jr., blue. And a Bobby Witt Jr., crest. Good rookie to get on that, on the Crusade lookalike. I say that with uh, all respect. I love Crusade. Alex Bregman. Alejo Lopez. Oh, that's weird. Is that... It's like... If you can see behind it, it's like it's stamped in behind it. Weird. It's almost like there's a shadow. 
And that's not normal because you can't see it on that one. Jeremy Pena. Nestor Cortez, blue. And then Alec Manoa on the velo. All right, guys. We're going on to our second hit. We're going to do this. We're going to take it. Nice blue right there. Spencer Strider. Joey Votto on the summit. Jazz Chisholm. Unheal Cruz. And then we'll do this. We'll do a flip. And we're going to get a Miguel Vargas. One of my favorite uh, minor league autos. Just based on... He just he just goes for it. Just just puts the Vargas. Um, yeah, technically not a rookie, I don't believe. Because I don't... Yeah, yeah, he was just in the minors. But yeah, I mean, that's a... I'm okay with that. So we ended up getting... As you can see, there's that. We end up getting this cool deja vu of Franco and Tatis. And one out of 25, Brian De La Cruz patch. Very cool. Um, yeah, guys, uh, this has been Panini Capstone Debut Edition. Two blasters. Um, now, as for the review. Now, we, we, the review stems from enjoyability, price, quality, all that stuff. So, I mean, if you factor everything together, I feel like the quality of this stuff is high. Um, some people might look at it and be like, well, it's a really simple design, but I, but I, I like simple design. I'm, I mean, I enjoy a simple design. I like, I love absolute. I think this stuff is for the price is way above value. I mean, the, the quality of the cards, now granted, I mean, I did get lucky. You don't expect to get something like that every time, but I mean, I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it four and a half. I think it's for what you get. And it, I think it's, it's definitely worth it. If you can see this stuff, pick up a blaster, you know, you're going to get some cool rookies. Now, granted it is a Panini product, so you're not going to get logos. So if that's something that really bothers you, just, you know, it, you have to really curb your like expectations, but I, it's, it's a good, it's good stuff. It's good stuff. And, uh, Panini, I know people were questioning, like, do we really need it? And I was like, uh, I mean, probably not, but they executed it really well. It, it's not, it's not really, it doesn't, doesn't feel cheap. It doesn't look cheap. So user judgment, but I'm going to give it four and a half stars or chicken legs. I apologize. All right, guys. That's going to do it for this video. I hope you did enjoy this Panini Capstone Debut Edition. And I hope you come back for the next video. Uh, please, if you would like this video, subscribe, share with some friends, hit the bell, do all that fun stuff. And please come on back for the next video because you never know what's going to show up. But there's only one way we finish videos around here, and that is... Say bye, Coco. See you later, guys.